Fortnite Chapter 5 Season 2, there are actually a bunch of secret skins you probably didn't know about. After all, there's only a few different areas on the Fortnite Island where they show up. One of them being the Underworld Minions, that'll appear each and every single time you fight any of the Underworld bosses. The other being the Olympian Minions. These are basically the same thing, but only appear whenever you're fighting one of the Olympian gods. What most people didn't know, you're actually able to unlock these as a free skin. But first, if you don't hit the thumbs up button on this video, in exactly 111 days, whenever you log on to Fortnite, this will happen. No! But if you do with the thumbs up button, in exactly 111 days when you log on to Fortnite, this will be waiting for you. The choice is all yours, so choose carefully. But ladies and gentlemen, we've wasted too much time. We got a bunch of awesome stuff to cover in this video, including a super secret free skin for everyone. Let's get into it. Now, super quickly, before we showcase and unlock the free skin, first things first, ladies and gentlemen, Epic Games made one of their biggest mistakes ever. It actually has to do with the fishing holes, fish themselves, fishing rods, and even the brand new Sharon NPC. I know that might sound like a weird combination. Trust me, Epic Games messed up big time. So check this out. I'm sure by this point, every single one of us have tried fishing in this season at least one time. Without a doubt, it's more difficult than any other season before because the amount of fishing holes have been drastically decreased, and it seems like there's only a few areas on the island where you're actually actually able to successfully fish. On top of that, if you actually put in all the time and effort to get a fishing pole and then actually find some fishing holes, stuff you're going to get isn't going to be very good at all. Probably just giving you a flopper or a gray submachine gun. The best case scenario is a shield fish, which is actually pretty rare. And we all know the secret to getting good fish in Fortnite, and that is to actually use the pro fishing rod. It's essentially the exact same as a normal fishing rod, except it gives you a much, much higher chance of catching better rarity fish. Bad news is pro fishing rod hasn't been in Fortnite ever since chapter 4 season 1. And this brings us to the very first part of Epic Games' mistake. Because check this out. If you actually go to this little house, you will find one of the brand new NPCs added last week, known as Sharon. And as you can see, Epic Games accidentally made it so he sells the pro fishing rod. But that's only part one of the mistake, because watch what happens when we buy it, and then make our way over to the closest fishing area. You'll never believe what happens, because check this out. Right now, we have a bunch of fishing holes in front of us, and we also have the pro fishing rod in our inventory. Watch this, lads. We'll go ahead and throw it in the the water and wait for a fish to bite and now we'll reel it in absolutely nothing happens now this is actually a legitimate glitch that happens each and every single time you try and catch anything with the pro fishing rod for some reason you'll literally never ever catch a single fish i was so excited to finally be able to get some good rarity fish in fortnite because obviously that's the whole point of the pro fishing rod epic games literally broke this thing so incredibly badly that there's no point in using it. don't worry though because there is an even better way of catching fish in fortnite and all you need to do is find your yourself a shield breaker grenade and then throw it at any of the fishing holes it'll literally eliminate all of the fish in that area hopefully epic games decides to fix this soon boy oh boy do i miss catching some awesome rare fish but don't worry coming up next we're gonna unlock these free skins but first recently you guys have been loving the glitches i've been showing off in case you missed it in the last video i posted i showed you guys how to do a super super goofy glitch you made your character basically walk around the fortnite map one hand to the sky like an absolute fool and in the video before that I showed you guys how to basically get god mode I sliding down this little zip line and glitching into a rock, as well as countless other glitches that I've showcased throughout the current season. Here we are jumping out of the battle bus, lads, because we have a new super crazy overpowered glitch that thankfully is incredibly easy to pull off and only takes a few quick seconds. First things first, as soon as you jump out of the battle bus, you're going to want to start making your way in this direction. Head towards the one unnamed location with the absolutely massive windmill. First things first, right when you get here, you're going to want to get all of the loot that you possibly can to so make sure you search the entire house and open up any and all chests that you find, because this glitch will make it incredibly easy to get a victory royale. You're just going to need to make sure that you have enough ammunition to make it through the game. Once you're done with that, you're going to need to collect a little bit of materials. You really don't need much at all. Like literally 40 will get the job done. Then you're going to want to make your way inside of the windmill. Here you'll find even more loot. So go ahead and get even more ammunition. Then you're going to want to make your way to the top floor. Once you're here, you're just going to want to break out one of the ceiling panels just like this and then have your character jump on up. The next steps are pretty easy. Pull out your building materials, build one wall just like this. You're then gonna wanna build another wall directly on top of that, and then carefully edit the top three tiles. If done correctly, you should have one normal wall with a little half wall sitting right on top of it. The rest is pretty easy, ladies and gentlemen. Just build a ramp right behind you, just like I did, and then leap and jump up on top of the wall you just built. Check this out, ladies and gentlemen. As you're able to see, we are in a super duper glitch spot, allowing us to actually see out of the top of the windmill. Full 360 degree panoramic view oh look we have an enemy right here look at this come on oh yes we eliminated him that's right ladies and gentlemen you're literally able to somehow shoot through this wall as well oh there's another enemy right here bro this spot is so overpowered 
They have no idea I'm here. And they will never know. Come on. Yes, that's another one. Bro, this spot is literally so overpowered. It is so incredibly unfair. Oh, right here, right here, right here. Yes! Yeah, now you can see why I told you to get as much ammo as possible. Because this is easily the most overpowered glitch I've ever showcased on the channel. The best part is, you're not even stuck here. At any moment, you could drop down and continue playing the game. But that's what I'm messing around. Let me show you how to unlock this free skin. And I'm sure by this point in Chapter 5 Season 2, each and every single one of us have gotten an opportunity to go and fight against one of the four different bosses on the Fortnite Island. I'm sure you've all noticed whenever you fight any of these bosses, not just fighting them, because each one of them actually have a bunch of different different henchmen or minions that you need to defeat first. If you decide to challenge a boss in the underworld biome, then you'll fight against the underworld minions. Basically, these dinky looking henchmen wearing some silver knight helmets that are typically pretty easy to defeat. On the flip side, if you decide to fight a boss in the Olympian biome, you'll get to fight the Olympian minions that are basically the same thing, except they're made up of gold and they are equally easy to defeat. By now, I'm sure we've all eliminated a ton of both the different minions belonging to the underworld as well as the Olympians. But that's not actually how you unlock their skills. Instead, check this out, ladies and gentlemen. As you're able to see right now, we're dropping into a game. We're not actually going to be making our way towards Mount Olympus or towards the Underworld. That's not where these skins are unlocked at all. Instead, we're going to land right here at the Ship It Station. This will make more sense in a second why exactly we landed here. But essentially, we need to wait for something to happen on the Fortnite Island. And this is just a nice little center location. So whenever it does happen, we won't be all that far from it. Oh, hold on, boys. We got some enemies here with me. Ah, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, we got one. What about this second one? Boom! Thanks for playing, buddy. What we're actually waiting for is for some of the absolutely massive forecast towers to be revealed. In case you didn't know, across the Chapter 5 Season 2 Island, there are a grand total of five different forecast towers. Honestly, these things aren't really that useful at all. And I personally have never actually really used one even a single time. But they are kind of cool. Whenever you go up to them, they'll actually reveal all of the future storm circles for you. But not just that, because at these forecast towers, they are actually guarded very, very heavily. By none other than, you guessed it, the minions themselves, as well as one other brand new character as well that goes by the name The Commander. Now, we do need to wait for the very second storm circle to appear in order for the forecast towers to be revealed, which is also where we'll be able to get our free skin. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, it finally happened. The forecast tower has been activated. And there are the minions I was talking about, ladies and gentlemen, as well as The Commander leading them. Here we go. Let's light them up. First things first, we'll get the minions. Come on, there's one. There's two. Now for the hard part, boys, we got to eliminate the commander himself. Well, not actually that difficult. Okay, that was actually really, really easy. Upon elimination, they will drop this for you, being a key card for the forecast tower. You're going to want to pick that up. Go ahead and add it to your inventory. Make your way back to the forecast tower. All we need to do now is secure the forecast by hitting that button. The very next storm circle has been revealed for us. But as it stands right now, the only way we know of being able to use those minion skins is obviously by using the Mystique skin in her built-in emote that literally allows you to steal the skin of any enemy you last eliminated. Oh, we got some gunshots going on over here, boys. Get ready for this. Get ready for this. Oh, this is going to be nasty. This is going to be nasty. I missed. No way. No worries. Round two. Round two. Round two. Ah! All right. I'm done embarrassing myself. I'm done embarrassing myself. Thanks for playing, hippos. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're not even done yet. There's another one. Come on, buddy. Thanks for playing, butch. And look what they did to my Lamborghini. They shot the windshield out and popped one of the tires, bro. That's so toxic. Yep. 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 Enemies over here. I barely see him, bro. My aim is horrible. Oh, we got him somehow. Oh, right there, right there, right there. I see him, I see him. Let's get involved. What do you say, boys? No. No. I have the worst aim ever. No. Yes. Screw it, screw it, screw it. Thanks for playing. Okay, calm it down, buddy. Let's be friends. What do you say? What do you say, buddy? No need to be this toxic towards me, lad. All right. I guess there was a reason. Oh, I see you, buddy. Stop shooting at me. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Bro literally took all of my shield, dude. Ooh, but he gave me a mini shield and a big shield. Oh my goodness. This dude literally just appeared out of thin air, bro. What? Yes. Bro, so did this guy. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Whoa. I barely have any health left, dog. What just happened? I need to drink some shield so badly, dog. All right, let's finish him. Come on. One more. What? Yes. Oh, and we got the win out in nowhere. That is absolutely incredible. As soon as the free skins are available for everybody to unlock, I'm going to make sure you guys know about it by making a tweet over at my Twitter account, at home at GamesYT. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Have an absolutely incredible rest of your day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.